Morning everybody, Andy from Snow Camp Shore up um, oh, on the dog walk and um, as you can see by the title of this live everything is currently closed in Caprun I've been keeping my eye on it this morning because you can see it's extremely windy up there and um, would you believe it the dog's going to the toilet um, but everything at the moment is closed I could see that Gletcher Jet 2 was out but nothing else was out if you are heading over from Zell, then you may want to just hang on where you are. Hello, Sheldon. Um, because they have just updated the website. Everything is closed. Uh, there will be another update at 9 o'clock. Just give me one second, folks. I've got to pick up a dog poop. Come here, dog. Got the trickiest dog poop bag known to men. One second. There we go. Snow White. Ah, put my finger in it. One second, folks. Not the first time, won't be the last. Um, so, yeah, at the moment, folks, if you are over in Zalem stay where you are because the glacier is currently closed, as is. I believe the mice goggle as well is what the website says. Although I can see the connection is coming out onto the line. But you can definitely see that Gletcher Jet 4 is not open. Um, if you look at the top of the glacier, let me just turn this around. You may be able to just see on the top there is a lot of snow being blown off the peaks. There's also an avalanche blast just there. Um, we did have snow last night as we expected um, so it snowed quite low down um, so Rizal will have had a refresh the glacier will have a lot of snow on it but at the moment because of the wind and the wind today is 90 to 130k because of that strong wind at the moment everything even Gletcher Jet 1 is closed um, now whether that means Panorama Barn is still open but it's funny because yesterday the wind was very strong and it was lower down rather than higher up um, in the middle of the glacier where we were skiing it was actually not too bad the wind but when we came down Gletcher Jet 1 you could definitely feel it if anybody knows Gletcher Jet 1 it's a double a double cable lift so it barely moves in the wind so if they've got that closed at the moment that wind must be pretty strong down low but what I would suggest folks is if you are in Caprona or you're in Zell or Salbach and you're planning on coming to the glacier today, then just check the Kitsteinhorn official website. On the top there is an icon of a cable car. If you click on that, it will open and tell you all of what's open and what's closed. But at the moment, everything is closed. The next update's at 9 o'clock. I don't even know what time it is now. Is it about... Oh, it's 8 o'clock, okay. So in an hour there'll be an update. Um, buses are already full going past... Um, last night Caprun filled up. It had been quite quiet in the number of hotel rooms that were taken. And last night the village did fill up because obviously today, Good Friday, people have taken the Friday off, got a long weekend. Um, and we did expect the weekend to be quite busy. But there was a considerable increase in the cars in the village last night. My car park is always a good indication because a lot of the apartments in my building are rental apartments and we had very few cars uh, on Wednesday night and then last night Thursday it, or this morning it's full the car park was totally full so lots of people here it's going to be busy and at the moment the glacier is closed the weather for tomorrow is stronger wind um, so it could absolutely be a, a everyone to zell situation uh, luckily Zell had some snow last night as well so that will be refreshed but uh, if the glacier doesn't get open and they normally can open Gletcher Jet 1 and Gletcher Jet 2 and they keep the Langveed run open which is just one run but um, at the moment nothing is open so yeah check the Kitsado website click on that cable car icon click on that cable car icon and then it will tell you what is open and what isn't um, Malika has just posted what it says at the moment um, which is interesting because when I looked at it it said 
the Lechnerberg was open. Well, the Lechnerberg's a green field, so that's definitely not open. Um, but at the moment, everything's closed because of the storm. Nine o'clock's the next update. Um, whether the wind's getting stronger as the day goes on or getting less, I'm not too sure. I didn't check. But there we go, folks. There's a good number of you watching, so I'd like to see a good number of likes. Don't be shy with the likes. Share this if you know people who are in Zalemzi or Capron. Pass it on to them, because I guarantee most people are just stood at the bus stop. They haven't checked the status of the lifts. We've been looking at it since six this morning because we knew it was going to be windy. It's been windy all week, and it's going to continue to be windy until it looks like Tuesday when it drops off a little bit. And that's going to be after another massive snow that is due to fall on Monday. Anyway, folks, it's Andy from South Camps Europe. Just with that update that currently everything is closed in Caprun. Next update's nine. If anything significant happens, I'll jump back on. But other than that, I'll be staying down in the village today, doing a bit of admin. And yeah, keep your posted via the Facebook page. Bye for now, everybody.